Hey everyone, it's Abby Andrew and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing another affordable wigs haul. Last time I did this, it was with Shein wigs, which are all extremely affordable and very low cost, but I was quite surprised with the quality of those wigs as well. So if you wanna check out my Shein wig review video, then you can check on the link on the side of the page or linked below. But for today's video, I'm going to be talking about different Amazon wigs. Now, on Instagram, for some reason, I've been getting a ton of DMs from multiple different Amazon wig sellers offering me free wigs, and I have a hard time turning down free wigs, even though I have so many. I wanted to try them out, show you guys these different options, and um, see what you think, and definitely comment below your thoughts on all of these as I show them, and they will, of course, as always, all be linked in the description of this video. And before I get into the video, I just wanted to mention this wig that I'm wearing right now as well. This is one of my more like high-end wigs, and it's just one of my favorite styles. This is one I've been wearing a lot lately. This one is called Cheyenne from Renee of Paris. So now I'm gonna go ahead and jump right into the first wig. So the first wig is this really fun bright electric blue wig. So the first thing I noticed when I opened this package is they actually give you so many cute little gifts and freebies. So you get a pair of false eyelashes, as well as a really cute keychain. This one's a little panda bear. I think there's also some stickers in there as well, I can't tell. And they also send you a wig cap. Now, I don't typically wear wig caps because I just wear the wigs on my bald head because I do have alopecia and I am totally bald. Uh, but some people who also have alopecia still choose to wear wig caps. Or maybe if you're buying this, you might not have alopecia. So that's really nice to have because you don't have to buy it separately. And then of course, as soon as I saw that bright blue color, I got super excited. So let's check this out. So. First impressions, this hair does feel really nice and silky. So let's try it on. So it actually does have some sort of lace part and lace front. Now it's not like a true lace part, but it does kind of have that um, trying to like mimic a scalp kind of look. We do have a type of adjustable strap on the back. This is the kind of adjustable strap that like hooks into the little slots here. So if you wanted to tighten it, you could just unhook this and tighten it. Now I have like a smaller sized head, so I am gonna move it more towards the middle. It also has combs inside as well for if you do have your own hair. So there's one comb here, one comb here, and then one at the base of the neck. And then there is the kind of semi skin top. Now it is like a cheaper version, but that is something that allows these wigs to be on the more cheaper, affordable end. And then it has that little patch of lace front as well. And this is interesting because it's just tied like right there to the front of the wig. So I'm not really sure if that's going to really have the effect of like a true lace front, but let's see how this looks on. Wow. Oh my gosh. First of all, that is so long and luscious and beautiful. Okay, let me adjust it. I definitely am gonna have to cut this lace front because it's just kind of hanging there in the middle and it also doesn't even match my skin tone at all. So I might even just cut it out completely. I think that'll look better. I love when lace fronts are kind of more on the transparent side so they can match any skin tone, whereas this is like a little bit too tan for my skin tone, that it will probably be pretty noticeable if I kept that on. But let me just show you the style. This is actually quite a pretty style. It's nice and flowy. It doesn't seem to be getting tangled too easily. It's quite long, let me back up. It matches my outfit really well today too. So this is really fun. I also like the roots that it has going on because that kind of lets it have more of like a realistic hair look as if your own roots are growing in. Now I am gonna go ahead and try cutting down this lace front and see if that makes it look a little more natural in that aspect. I might just cut it off completely honestly because it's not really doing anything in terms of making it look natural. So let's see. So that kind of left a little bit of a sliver of lace front right by the front that does kind of give it more of a natural look. So that is cool indeed. So that's all I'm gonna do for this wig for now, but even just on its own right out of the package, it is quite a pretty style. The hair still doesn't seem to be getting too tangly or anything like that, and you can do some really cute things with this. Comment below which cosplay characters you think would be good for this wig, because I'm definitely going to use this electric blue wig for some pretty cool cosplays. And let me know if you wanna see another video as well of me taking these wigs and modifying them to look even more realistic. There are some other things you can do, like tweezing the part to widen it up and make it a little bit less uniform. That might help make it look a little bit more realistic, but even just as it is for the low cost, it is a pretty cool style. 
Now moving on to the next wig, which is a fun, bright pink color. This wig actually came with, let's see, it also came with a wig cap. Also came with a set of lashes. I think this was actually from the same Amazon seller, so it came with some pretty similar stuff. Another pair of lashes and another keychain, but this one's actually different, so that's cute. This one also came with a brush. This one has a lot of freebies. It's nice that it comes with a cute little travel size wig brush. And whatever this thing is, I guess it's like, it's like a little detangling comb too. <laughs> that's cute. So here is what this one looks like. It's this really fun bright pink bubblegum pink color with bangs and it also kind of has like a skin part going on as well. Again, not too shiny from what I'm noticing, which is always a good sign. And then for the cap construction, it has that kind of like flower tied cap on the inside. It has the combs, which again are good for if you do have your own hair and want to clip it to your hair. And then it also has those kind of hook adjustments as well. So now let's try this one on. This one actually looks so cute and fun. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, this is so cute. I feel like cotton candy right now because of the shirt as well. I love the pattern of these curls. Again, not too shiny, not too tangly. Definitely comment below which cosplays I could wear with this. Kind of reminds me of like Princess Bubblegum is the first one that comes to mind, but I'm sure there are a ton of others. The curls are just so bouncy too. So all three of these first wigs were from the same seller, so this is the third one from the same Amazon store. So far they've all been pretty cute. Uh, this one also comes again with the fake lashes, free wig cap, and another one of those cute little keychains and nail stickers as well. So this one is a really cool kind of forest green color, almost with a blue tint. This is really nice because if you looked at it from a distance, it almost looks like it's maybe dark brown or black hair, but it has just like a really subtle green tint to it, which I am a huge fan of. But yeah, it's just a very subtle, oh, that's a really, that's capturing the color really well right there. And again, not too shiny. So it really does just look like nicely dyed human hair, but it is synthetic. So for the cap construction, it has again, that flower type of netting on top. So I think it does have like a kind of skin part on top as well the hooks for your hair, and then it has the hook adjustments as well. So let me go ahead and tighten these. Again, a super cute style. Honestly, I love wigs with bangs because you don't have to, have to worry about the hairline or anything. It just automatically covers that so there's no blunt edge. Love these little beachy waves. Love the shade of green. The shade of green kind of reminds me of Sailor Neptune from Sailor Moon, of course. And it also reminds me of Tornado from One Punch Man, kind of like a dark green. Her hair is probably a little bit more bright green, but it kind of reminds me of her a little bit. Again, love the flowiness of this wig, and I feel like it is pretty nice hair texture as well. So definitely a fan of this one as well. Let me know in the comments, as usual, which other characters you think I could cosplay with this awesome color. Now moving on to the next one, which is from a different Amazon seller. It is this really gorgeous, bright orange wig. This one is awesome. This one I've actually already used for a TikTok. If you don't follow me on TikTok, you can go check me out over there, Abby Andrew YT. I filmed a really cute fairy TikTok with this. It reminds me a lot of Bloom from the Wings Club, so I will 100% be using this for Bloom for Wings Club. This one did come with some freebies as well. It came with a wig cap and it also comes with this really pretty headband. So all these wigs have pretty similar cap constructions. All lower cost wigs tend to have this really basic cap construction. It's pretty cool that a lot of them have this kind of fake skin part now, which is cool. And it has bangs as well, so no lace front because the bangs cover the hairline anyway, which again, I actually prefer. It has that floral top and the adjustable hooks on the back. So let me put this on and show you. It's just such a fun, vibrant color. So this one, again, will definitely be great for, it can, it can be great for everyday wear, but it will definitely be so great for some cosplays. And again, I've already worn this for a couple videos, so it is a little tangly, which was my own doing. But if you just have a nice basic detangling comb uh, designed for wigs, like this one from Renee of Paris, that's really great for curly wigs, for detangling curly wigs without brushing the curls out too much. So just be very, very gentle and comb from the bottom. And a wide tooth comb like this really helps to detangle without messing up the curls. I actually look like Bloom right now because this shirt is very Bloom as well. So this is so adorable. 
definitely a super fun and vibrant wig. Let me know in the comments below, of course, what other characters I can do with this wig. So Bloom from Wings Club is definitely what I'm going to do. Sam from Totally Spies, absolutely. So many amazing, iconic redhead characters. Last but not least, I have one more wig to show. This one is in a blonde color. This blonde is so gorgeous. I love how not shiny it is. That's pretty shocking for a low cost wig like this. This is a very, very, very nice shade. I love this. So this one has the kind of skin part top again that all the other ones had, as well as a little piece of lace front that that first one had. And this one also came with the wig caps and this cute little scarf thing as well. So it's kind of fun that all of these wigs came with cute little freebies. And this one kind of has that skin top part in the middle, the lace front from the inside, hooks on both sides and on the back, and the little hook adjustable straps. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my gosh. This looks very cute. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is a genuine reaction right now. I think this is the first time I've tried this wig on. It's so pretty. Wow. <laughs> this hair is so natural looking and the color is so natural looking. I am thoroughly impressed. Again, let me just go ahead and cut this lace front. So honestly, I feel like that lace front kind of wasn't doing anything either, but once you cut it off, I feel like it actually looks better. <laughs> so yeah, let me back up and show you the full length. Another gorgeous long wig. I don't think I have any wig that looks like this right now. This is so pretty. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me see how it looks with the little thing they gave me. This is so cute. <gasps> wait, wait, this is so cute. Oh my god. Okay, so I tied it kind of badly, but that's the effect I was going for, and it is quite cute like that. <laughs> So that is all the wigs that I have to show in this video. Definitely comment below which of these wigs was your favorite, and if you are going to pick up any of these for yourself as well. I can't decide which one is my favorite, so I will definitely love and use all of them, either for cosplay or this one I would totally just wear for like regular wear. <laughs> this is so gorgeous. Don't forget that you guys can find me on other social media platforms as well, like my Instagram where I post all sorts of wig and cosplay content at abbyandrew.yt. You can also find me on TikTok where I make cosplay videos as well at abbyandrewyt without the dot. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe to me on this channel for more wig and cosplay and fashion content. And thank you all so much for watching this video. I will see you next time. Bye.